What did you just call me? I called you Abraham Lincoln. Abraham Lincoln. That's a picture I liked of you it. dressing as Abe Lincoln. And I, I love. Did you come up with Abraham Lincoln? No. Or somebody else was a Jenny. Why would I call myself that? I don't. I don't. <laughs> I've done things like that about my myself. <laughs> I like to say nice things about me. You do. That's good. Hey, you, you, you got to be your own. Oh, something different about you. Well, oh, something different about me. Yeah, I don't know what it is. What is it? But I, I don't know. I'm what trying something new. Can you well, tell what it hold is? Hold on, ready? Ah, uh, kapow. <gasps> <laughs> Different colored earrings. earrings. What what color do you have on? They're just That's slightly like a canary? different. Canary? Canary. You're wearing Oh, and you're wearing two completely different two earrings. Two completely different you're earrings. Amazing. Yeah. With our today's special. You can do it's that. It's just a way to like sort of try something new. That's what Heidi suggests. You're shaking and it we up. like to be able to Shannon. try something new. Uh, it's also a really good excuse to buy two of our today's yeah, specials. Yeah, that's true. That's <laughs> true. And and what a deal we have today for you. Yeah. Don't you get just excited to see what Heidi's going to do next? Isn't it yeah. Great? yeah. Look at her. There she is, wearing two completely different color earrings. And of course, she has she's layered up her Today Special necklace as well. So you can always just try something new. She says, you know, just be playful with your jewelry. You can wear different color earrings. You can mix and match your Today Special. This Today Special is exciting. With it. it is $99.95 and you're getting the set. There's that beautiful chrysolite color and that gorgeous green. It is so beautiful. And then you also have the earrings. You have the smoke topaz color option, which is topaz and is beautiful. Honey crystal. Remember, they also come with the earrings, your choice of pierced or clip. Then there's that canary, which is in person, so much more vibrant even than that. It's just absolutely gorgeous gorgeous, gorgeous, light honey yellow. And then that crystal, very, very limited. Oh, how many left, Kyle? Only 250 left in the crystal. We're, now we're already uh, 4,200 sold of our today's special. So this is your chance to get it. Look at that gorgeous rose. It's like an antique rose, which is just so beautiful and vintage. And then there's the aqua color. So difficult to be able to choose between them, but remember, you are getting for really the price of, this is about, it was modeled after a $399 necklace that we have at HSN on hsn.com. Uh, and you're also getting the earrings. And if we had the earrings for $99.95, that would be a steal. But today you're getting the necklace plus the earrings. You can choose that right now or you can wait for a little bit of a longer presentation in the next hour. But guys got some great stuff cooking up for us in the kitchen. All right, thank you, Shannon. So we look forward to a full, uh, or I should say a more fuller presentation coming up uh, in the next hour at the top of the hour with our Heidi Doss jewelry. But this show's all about really cool stuff that you can use around the house, especially in the kitchen. And, uh, if you own our RoboTwist uh, Deluxe Automatic Can Opener, We'd love it if you'd give us a call because I'll tell you, this has made it so much easier for so many folks out right? there that have issues with their hands exactly. to be able to open up cans. My good friend, Mark Gill's here. How are you, my friend? how simple this is. Literally the touch of a button, right? It is just the touch of a button, guys. Listen, Saturday morning cartoons lied to you. They promised you robots for everything, cleaning, driving, right? flying, everything. I can't give you that, but what I can give you is a bona fide, real deal robot that's going to go ahead and take care of one of the most common problems we have in the kitchen. And that's getting those tough to open jars open and taken care of for us. No matter yeah. what the jar, no matter what the size, all the way from one inch, all the way uh, to the family size, this is gonna take care of those tough jobs for you. Now, what you just saw happen was the claws Come in, right. grab now the lid, up. now they're gonna open up and release it. This is designed to be completely one hand or no hand operation, because at the end of the day, that's what it's all about. The difficulty and the trouble of trying to get into jars like this, you guys. Yeah. Now listen, we've all got our little uh, secret ways of doing it, right? Sure. But here's what I don't want. I don't want something so simple as not being able to get into a jar as the reason that my mom, who's by herself, right. has to change her dinner plans, or my eight or nine year old that comes home by herself at lunch Can't can get it. into that food because yeah. what are they doing they're banging it with a knife they're banging yeah, it on no. the counter and that's not what we want to have happen and guy what you've got here is a real gear a heavy right. solid almost like a transmission gear you just press one button the padded feet grab the side of the jar and away yeah. you go i'm going to show you that one more time okay right. now this is an exclusive design just for our friends here at hsn see the two rubber feet here it's the only place in the marketplace that has those and what it does is it allows you to use all different kinds of jars so watch what's going to happen it's going to grab onto the side so it's got a nice long hard, uh, a hard grab on it and then that torque is simply going to go wow. as yeah. hard as it needs to to pop the top of that jar open you never ever ever again have to worry about them wow. sticking grab 
stabbing, banging, nothing, guys. We've taken care of one of the most common problems in the kitchen so you can get back well, to the dishes you love and everything that you like to do in there. You know, there. it's like anything else, Mark. It's like as we get older, uh, you find yourself sort of less empowered. Exactly. To yourself. It's like, I, I know, because my mom will say, like, can you open this for me, honey? What this does is it gives you that back, you know? And, and you know, it's, it's such... It's such a small thing, but right. it can be, but you know when you add these things up that you can't do, Ooh. it makes you feel really bad exactly. about it. You're like, oh my gosh, when I was younger, I could do that. You know what? <laughs> it, it doesn't matter. You could have issues with your hands. You could have, uh, you know, arthritis, whatever it is that's bothering your hands, that's making it difficult to, for, for you to open things, right? Carpal tunnel, all these totally. things that we have as we get older. Uh, and what this is going to do is it's going to make that job a little bit easier for you. We just brought this back in. Uh, it's ten dollars under the retail price of thirty. It's only nineteen ninety five. It's free shipping and handling, and you can use this on a variety of sizes. What's nice about this, as Mark showed you, is that it'll adjust. Exactly. And basically, basically it's, it's like having two extra hands because one holds the jar, right? the other one opens it. Well, that's the problem yeah. right there. As soon as you have to use two hands, now you're dealing with the issue, like you said, of arthritis, carpal tunnel, any of that kind of stuff. Have a look at that, guys. That jar of pickles that nobody can open. Are you kidding me with that? Now, let me show you the machine itself, all right? Because, uh, you know, a lot of people look at stuff like this and go, okay, it's, a, it's another gadget for the kitchen. Do me a favor, guy. Yeah. Go ahead and hang on to that because I want people at home to know how substantial of a piece of equipment yeah. that is. It's not light. It's no, not airy. No. This has an actual gear built you inside. Can see and you them can underneath. see it. Yeah, right? You got it, too. We're both showing exactly. it at the same time. Have a look at those teeth, you guys. Yeah, like car gears. Exactly. Right. Guys, nothing's going to stop that. It's battery operated, so you don't have to charge it. There's no cords to worry about. And I want you to watch this. There's one button on top. That's it. As soon as you push that, watch what happens. The four padded feet start to enclose on the jar. It's gonna close in on the top part and then it's gonna grab the bottom so you've got all of the force and torque that you need. And then watch. So now there's no knife, there's no running under hot water, there's no banging it on the counter, there's no sore wrist. And I don't have to worry about mom on her that. own or Pop the kid right at lunchtime <laughs> not being able to get in there. Because you know what happens, right? It all, it, you know, we close a jar and some goon like me comes over and goes, here, I got it, and puts it back in the fridge. Right. Nobody can open that again. Or if you've got mason jars or jams or jellies sure. that get sugary on the inside. Pick, pickled stuff, which you, which you keep in there Ooh. for months because exactly. it lasts so long. But what happens is those jars get sticky gummy. They even can rust a little bit. Right. And once that happens, you, you'll never get those things exactly. off. And I agree with Mark, it's kind of dangerous to Isn't be whacking great? this thing with the back of a knife <laughs> or, or you know or, and you know they'll say the little the rubbery grip pads but all those you still need a lot of strength to open things well up let's with talk that. about that listen this yeah. is not the only solution out there in the marketplace i'll show you that there when we come back and have a look here guys the two padded feet grab the lid the two exclusive extra padded feet grab the body of the jar right. and it twists that's what it does it twists and it twists as long and hard as it has to to get that jar off it won't yeah. actually stop working until that jar is done so guys let's have a look here the the problem with everything that's out there is they require two hands no matter how much they go to help you like they this guy's out there i actually I think that's for the oil change in the yeah. car pretty sure i saw that at the dentist's office I don't know uh, these guys is. are kind of silly yeah. i don't know what that does i've never seen a jar that big and honestly i have no idea what that does yeah that's just... <laughs> guys this is what i'm talking about the I solution think that, that's probably its best use just to make Mark look funnier. <laughs> so guys, look at this. You can see the little dip in there. You know that that's right. under vacuum. And again, when you get into things like sugary jars and jams and candies, sure. and it comes time to like, crank on that, right. you're always going to have to run and you know find somebody in the house that can open it, help you out with it. Well, yeah. wouldn't it be nice, no matter where you are, what type of jar it is, what type of meal Watch you want to have. Watch what happens again. This yeah. is going to take care of that common problem in the house. It's an actual robot for your kitchen. It does one thing and one thing only, and that's make this job easier. Watch what's going to happen. It's secured the top lid. It's going to grab the body of the you jar, it and it's too. simply going to twist until you hear that pop. There's the pop. Isn't that easy? All right, listen, we only have about six minutes left to spend on this. We're going to put our clock up pretty soon, so if you would like to get it, what a great way to enable somebody to be able to do things on their own. You know, every time we, we, we have shows like this, I always think yep. of my mom. My, my mom is 85. You and me both. You and me both. And I, and I go to her house, and I'm telling you, you know, it's like, honey, could you um, fix that lamp? Could you do this? Right. You, you know, and I know it's, you know, she doesn't want to ask strangers to do stuff like that. But the more things that she can do on her own, the mm -hmm. better she feels absolutely. with all that stuff. You know, because she still right. likes to cook dinner. Mm -hmm. She still likes to make things. You know, we people dropping food off and things like that for her at her, at her condo. Um, but this is a way to sort of... 
empower people to be able to do things alone. And it, it's not just for the older folks out there. Hey, listen, there are people that have issues with their hands. My wife brings me jars all the time. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> just, you know, you could just be somebody that's, you know, a slight in stature. You just don't have the power. Not only that, but certain jars are harder than others. Absolutely. Small jars are always yep. very difficult because you, you have nothing to grab onto. Right. And you get condensation in the fridge. Right. You get wet on your hands. The Robo Twist doesn't care about any of that. All this is going to do is the one job that it was designed to do every single time. And you heard that pop. And that's what it's all about, guys, because you know what the procedure is. You grab that knife. Knife, you start banging on banging it. You run it, it yep. under the hot water to try and open it. You bang it on the counter, guys. These are glass jars. The last thing I want my uh, uh, senior citizen mom or my nine or ten year old to do is to be banging right. jars on exactly. the counter just so yeah. they can get into food. Guys, to have something like this stop your passion for cooking, stop your love for the kitchen, stop your love for all things. Uh, you know, culinary and creative. Right. If you decide to do that over something like this, you don't have to anymore, you guys. It's a one-handed solution. That's all it is. It requires no force, no torque, no Just anything. All you need to do is push that button and watch what happens here. The two claws on the bottom that are padded are gonna grab the side of that jar and the two top ones are gonna go ahead and get a good, strong grip on the lid. As soon as that happens, That's Robo really Twist cool. is ready. Here comes the gear. Here comes the reason this is. Here comes that pop. I love the That's, That's what that. you're looking for. Well, and if you don't think it's got the power to do it, you're wrong. See, see, really, what it involves is is about is a certain amount of leverage. You know, when we do right. things, we try to twist, bend, and turn, and try to put all our muscle into it. But you've got to be going one arm in one direction, the other in the opposite. It's a kind of a hard thing to coordinate, right. and depending on the size of the jar, mm -hmm. that can be even more of a task. Exactly. When they created this item, <laughs> as we said, they put little cogs inside, little teeth inside, so you're using leverage. As Mark said, you're using torque, just like you know, using your vehicle. Right, exactly. When, when, the, you know, when the vehicle accelerates, it, the gears change out so that it can spin the wheels more readily, and that's what this does. So when Mark hits the button, you'll watch. The top will grab the jar mm -hmm. lid, stabilizing and securing that, and then the bottom does it, and then it kicks into it's little motion where it uses those gears to turn it. It's truly, it's it's a really, really cool this, item. Honest, at the end of the day, you yeah. guys, this is an advanced piece of robotic equipment yeah, made, 20 to, bucks, made to pop this jar open. That's all it does is make your life easier in the kitchen. Did you hear that? How perfect is that? Now, you can pop it off right now if you want, or if you just want to let it finish doing its job, watch this. It's going to release the top, then it's gonna yeah. release the bottom. And you literally are practically hands off with this procedure. So I want you to think back to that time, you couldn't get that jar open. You ran to somebody in the house for them to get it open. The the, the little one at lunchtime Ooh, says you. Yeah. You just did the little cherry jar? The maraschino you, cherries, you, capers. Yeah, you Ooh. brought up stuff that has, <laughs> but stuff that has like a sugary consistency inside yep. that turns into like a glue. Awful Cause stuff. you've got like, and, and whether it's, you know, uh, the, a little thing of uh, like honey jars. Anything oh, sugary that so can crystallize around the inside. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And heaven forbid you've got one of those home canning jars with a grape or a jelly or a jam, and you've forgotten that in the fridge. Now, guys, uh, this particular jar is square. Doesn't matter if they're square. Doesn't matter if they're round. Anywhere from one inch to three inches. That's single serving to family yeah. size. The Robo Twist is going to take care of all of it. Listen, we love our kitchen customers here at HSN. We love your creativity. We love to hear the things that you do on the website. We love when you call in. But yeah. what I can't stand is the thought of any one of our customers, our customers' friends, our customers' families, not being able to enjoy that time in the kitchen over something as simple and easily solved as being able to open up that jar. And it is a real problem. People with arthritis and carpal tunnel and wrist troubles. If you've got somebody elderly in the family that's changing their menu because they can't get into jars like this anymore. If you've got a little one at home that you hate the idea of banging on the knife, banging on the counter, banging on the hot water. You don't want to have to have that. Put an actual robot in the drawer. It takes up no space at all, about as much as a can opener. And this is gonna take care of that pesky, hard to do job in the kitchen that's stopping you from being able to do what you want to do in there. Hands off, one button, the teeth close in, yeah. the stabilizers close in, and guys, that's it. No matter how yeah. tight that's on there, we got you covered. You know what's nice too is that you don't have any cords with this. It's battery yep. operated. So if you want to bring this with you when you travel, if you've got an RV or a boat or, or uh, you know, you're camping somewhere and you have jars that you need to open, you can take this wherever you go. It only weighs, what, a pound? Maybe not. Exactly. Even less very, than that. very easy to use. So don't let those jobs around the house. You know, these are 
are things that we take for granted when we're younger. Yep. We take for granted, you know, uh, that we're going to be able to do this stuff. But as you get older, I, I've, I've actually cut my hand trying to open a dang yes, jar sir. one time. Yes, you sir. You know, with a little piece of metal on there. So here's the thing. If you have issues with your hands or if you're just a person that wants a little extra help, you don't want to always wait for your kids to show up so you can open a can. I mean, that's got to be yep. about as deflating as, as <laughs> it can be. You know, you're like, right? I just want to open up a can of salsa. That's it. That's all it. I want to do. Well, listen, it, right? doesn't, it doesn't really matter. I mean, we, we keep talking about our moms all and our aunts. sizes, too. Exactly. Everywhere from one inch, which is your single serving or something like capers or the maraschino cherries that you saw, all yeah. the way up to and including the family size three and a half to four inch lids yeah. are going to pop right off, Sarah. Gonna, so your I'm peanut butter is your jam. I'm going to get this for Shannon. You know why? I don't. I'm so tired of <laughs> helping her with her opening up jars. <laughs> Every time I come to work, she's like, hey, will you have this jar of olives for me? I'm like, first of all, why do you need olives? at work. That's and then I'm like, oh, okay. <laughs> Happy hour. I get you. Sorry, Shannon. I love she's it. She's right there. I, I like it. to make fun of her because she's my friend. <laughs> All right. You're not going anywhere, right? I'm not going anywhere. No, I got some got garlic to you, talk about. Bro, I got one of those at home. It's really good. Shannon gave They're it to great. me. In fact. <laughs> Shannon. All right. Here's some information. I'm well, okay. Be right back. <laughs> Cooking is my life. Mmm. Cooking at home for my family is a special time. So I want everybody out there to have a great time in the kitchen while they're cooking. And the most important thing is to have the right appliances and the right pots and pans. I give it to all my chefs in the restaurant and they give me suggestions and they try them out. And so can you at home. Say hello to something new. New is smart. New is gorgeous. New is delicious. New is so you. Shop now and discover the perfect new for you. DG2 is comfort, stretch, style. That bootcut classic was the first jean I designed. The super stretch is a technological revolution. I love the Ponte jean. It makes you look so thin. That comfort waist is going to overtake the world of denim. Once you have that perfect fitting jean, wait and see how life changing it is. making things so much easier for you in the kitchen. Look at that hands-free peeling of garlic. If it only did that, it would be so worth it. But this is the brand new Garlic Master. This cuts the garlic fresh so you get that incredible fresh taste of garlic without getting it all over your hands, without having to cut it really finely. Look at that every single time perfectly. Now here's the thing, if you go into any professional kitchen, what do they all have in common? They smell like garlic, exactly. right? Fresh garlic because there is nothing like it. And Mark Gill is <laughs> hands-free showing us how simple it is to get the best fresh garlic. And I don't care if you buy it in a can, it <laughs> nothing tastes like fresh garlic exactly. in your cooking. Today you're getting two $8.32 and the value on this is amazing. It's $29.95 if you were to purchase them separately. Exactly. Or the, you know, the two pack. You get the <laughs> roller and the and, Yeah, two of these Peeler and two and of these the, yep. guys. You're going to get two of the peelers and oh two gosh. of the garlic masters from Genius. Now, guys, there's nothing in the world like fresh cut garlic, and everyone knows it. And there's so many ways you can use garlic. But here's what I don't want you to do. I don't ever want you to crush it. I don't ever want you to squeeze it. Because as soon as you do that, you end up compromising the reason for garlic. Ah. You end up wiping away and dissipating away all the reason for that taste and flavor. So I'll tell you what. We're going to get a couple of dishes going here with our garlic, and then I'm going to show you exactly how that works, okay? So we're gonna go ahead, we're gonna turn that down just a little bit, and I'm gonna take some of the garlic that we've got here, 
And I'm going to go ahead oh, and I'm going to sprinkle that in. Oh, that's sweet just hot with that garlic master. Isn't that beautiful? So it doesn't squish it or squeeze nope. it or, Not or mush it. Okay. Not at all. Interesting. We'll put the, gar the broccolini in there. Now, you oh. know, as soon as garlic hits that olive oil, the olive oil will pull all of those great flavors, those great nutrients, all of those great health benefits from the garlic to get it cooking. So I'm going to go ahead. We're going to get this sauteing. We're going to finish up our steak. Now, with our steak, here's what I want to do. I'm going to take a little bit of herb butter and put it on a couple of spots just like that and then watch this to bring that garlic flavor down into the steak i'm going to go ahead and i'm just going to twist and cut some fresh cut garlic right oh on top my of my gosh. steak to land into that butter and what's going to happen is as this steak finishes it's going to grab that fresh cut garlic and it's going to render and pull it down into that steak so guys let me show you how and why this works the way it does. We'll give that a little bit of a toss. We've got our garlic in there. I'm gonna turn that down a bit. Now here's how your garlic master works. What it does is it takes a clove of garlic and it cuts it into 81 equal pieces every time you do a turn. So watch this, couldn't be simpler to use. Everything is hands off. As long as you've got the skin on the garlic, you're never gonna get the smell on your fingers by holding it like this. So now I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna pop it in our garlic peeler. Do you see that? Now Shannon, you just start to roll. As soon as you feel Ah, that crisp, I can kind of hear it. It's huh. done. Look at that, guys. Look how easy that is. So all I'm going to do now is I'm going to pick this up like this. I I'm going to pop it inside. Have a look here. It goes right inside the chamber, just like that. Now, the top part is spring-loaded. So what that's going to do is it's going to force the garlic into the blades. So guys, we have a cool, cool animation here to show exactly how this works. And you'll see how that garlic comes out. Every time you turn it, it makes 81 equal pieces. Now think about that, 81 equal pieces. How hard would that be with a knife, you guys? Have a look here. As it goes onto the plate, you can see it coming out of the, out of the garlic master, right onto the plate. Every time you turn it, it makes 81 perfect cuts. How cool is that? Wow, so well, guys, you know what it reminds me of is that fresh, fresh chopped pepper, right? Exactly. I mean, there's nothing like fresh ground pepper. It's the same with garlic, and in your cooking, it makes a huge difference. Exactly. $24.95 to get this home. It's $8.32 on Flex. And remember, you're getting two of the garlic masters and two of the garlic peelers. Exactly. And this is the first time that you're seeing it, so we've got them available for you. If you're watching right now and you're thinking, well, you know, I buy it in the container. That's like buying pepper right? in, in, the, in the container, right? It's already <laughs> chopped up. You know it doesn't taste the same. Who knows how long it's been there. There is nothing like fresh garlic. And I just learned from you, Mark, mm -hmm. that we're not supposed to squish it, press it, grind it, mince it. It it doesn't, it doesn't right. give us as much flavor. Listen, garlic has something in it called thio sulfonate. Ooh, okay? Look, he's smart too. <laughs> look at that, right? <laughs> what that is is a compound. Oh, there we go. Oh, I love this. Area. Oh it's a my gosh, it smells it's incredible <laughs> in here. It's a compound <gasps> enzyme, and what it wants to do is it wants to be cut, but it, what it doesn't want is to be crushed. It doesn't want to be okay? crushed, okay. You're not going to find a self-respecting Italian restaurant anywhere in the country that's sitting there pressing garlic, squeezing garlic, uh, mashing garlic, and I'm going to show you why, okay? While this stuff, while my pans get kind of uh, uh, mm. hot and ready with our garlic here, let me show you the traditional way of, of, of using garlic. Normally people grab a knife, they grab their, uh, their, their clove there, they give it a smash. The second you do that, you've compromised that garlic. You've released everything that you want to go into your food by crushing yeah. it. Then what do we do? We go ahead and we grab one of these guys and we think that we're adding flavor. But watch this. You see that? You see that juice? Oh, look at all the juice. All that is is what you're gonna wipe away and what's gonna dissipate into your food. There's a big difference between this and what you're getting out of your garlic master. I want you to see this. I'm gonna just give it a couple of twists and I'm gonna put them by itself on the cutting board so you can see how perfectly and how evenly these are cut. Have a look here, guys. There's no mess, there's no mm. juice, it's not flowing all over the place. It's perfectly cut garlic every single time. So but let's head on over because here. because the juice is then inside and then that's what gets exactly. released in your food. That exactly. makes sense. Exactly, because what ends up happening, as soon as you crush it, as soon as you squeeze it, as soon as you puree it, you end up releasing all of that taste and flavor kind of mm. out into the wild and your food doesn't get it. You know, it's one of those little secrets that the restaurants keep for themselves. You know, you, you, you wanna have that reason to go out. You wanna have that reason right. to experience the restaurant, all right? So one of the things they're never going to tell you is their little tricks to make it taste 
just a certain way. And one of those is never, ever, ever crushing, mincing, or smashing their garlic. That's right. one thing they never do. So guys, let's have a look here. Uh, and you can see this. All of those pieces are evenly cut. Can you imagine how much time it would take with a knife to be able to do that? Oh I mean, honest to goodness, you'd be there all day. And the skill that it would take. <laughs> I was just at a, a delicious Chinese restaurant, the best one that I've found in Tampa. And I noticed little chunks of garlic is yep. what I would say. Little Absolutely. like this, like perfectly cut. Right. And I remember thinking, holy cow, how do they do that? And why isn't it overpowering like it didn't taste overpoweringly exactly. like garlic it was so aromatic it was right. so perfect so let me show you again exactly how this works you're going to get everything you need now listen there's no better flavor no better fl stinking rose no better vegetable mm. to add to your foods whether it's italian it really doesn't matter you guys because what garlic does it gives you that pungent flavor that's you know so just uh, uh well, exclusive to this kind mm -hmm. of uh topping and flavor but people don't realize all the health benefits that come with garlic, how it helps the uh, immune system, how it can help in your liver, how the enzymes can help with heart disease. It can help you with all of this stuff, you guys. All you gotta do is read up on the health benefits of garlic and you'll be amazed. Now look at that, perfectly peeled. Let me show you that again one more time because I gotta tell you, one of the worst things about having to work with garlic is the crushing and the smashing and the yeah. hitting it with the knife and getting your fingers too close to the knife. Drives you nuts, so guys, have a look and at that. And the stink on the fingers, it lasts for days. <laughs> right, uh -huh. so all you're gonna do is take this off just like this. Now you can use your fingers if you want, or you can use this guy and you never, ever, ever have to touch it. Now have a look. I'm gonna pop it right inside, just like that. And you can see here on the bottom, right there, there's your blade. 81 perfect square cuts every single time you rotate it. So guys, again, I have a great animation that shows exactly what happens in this machine when you give it a twist. And here's one of the things that I love, guys. You wanna talk about a company that's famous the world over for their products, their quality. Genius is it. That's who's bringing you the Garlic Master. And I'll tell you, these are personal friends of mine. Mm. And one of the things that I love about this company, whoops, there we go. This locks on the bottom. One of the mm -hmm. things that I love about Genius is all the, the decisions that are made about their products and their food are the decisions that are made like your house, around the dinner table, not the boardroom table. So you know that when you get this home, the quality is gonna be outstanding. And look at all of the garlic I got from one clove on the inside. Nothing smashed, nothing's crushed, nothing is oozing flavor all over the place where I don't want it to ooze. Just perfect results every single time. So whether it's pasta, whether it's steak, whether it's mm. broccolini, whether it's vegetables, whether it's shrimp, whether it's just a topper, whether you're adding, whether you're uh, uh, sauteing, it really doesn't matter, you guys. The results, have a look here with our shrimp, are perfect every single time. Now, you can use the Garlic Master to make uh, you know, a bunch ahead of time. You can go ahead and have one at the table to serve up whenever they need. But I want you to see that perfect shrimp. I want you to have a look at the perfect broccolini. And I want you to see that pasta. And as good as that looks, you guys, here's what I want you to do. Go ahead and mince a bunch ahead of time and get it nice and crispy. And I want you to go ahead and I want you to put that in the fridge. You are looking at the best salad topper pasta topper, steak topper, potatoes, fish that you've ever had in your life. They are mm. crunchy, they're sweet, they're pungent, and you never, ever, ever have to worry about crushing the garlic, getting it on your fingers, smelling up the whole house, smelling up the, the clothes. Your fingers never come in contact with it. You're never crushing it. You're never squeezing it. You're making 81 perfectly cut square pieces of garlic every single time you use it. Mm. You don't lose any flavor, you don't lose any of the pungency, and you don't lose any of the health benefits. And you know, speaking of health benefits, when you have really good flavored food, you're not adding extra oils or extra salt. If right. you are supposed to be on a diet where you're not having as much salt, try garlic with the Garlic Master. Exactly. Because you're getting all of the flavor, you won't even miss the salt, especially when you do it that crispy way. You're gonna be able to use that in place of any of your other flavorings. Just try it. For $24.95, remember, you're getting two. This is the first time that you're seeing it. You get the cutter and the peeler. Two of each. So easy to use. It is precision stainless steel cutting grid, so it 
creates perfect garlic cubes in seconds. And remember, garlic cubes, better for you and better for the garlic than squishing it and losing all of that flavor. Exactly. And you never ever have to touch it with your hands. So get it home for $8.32. Oh my gosh, with salsa, are you kidding me? Adding this to almost anything, keep one of these in the fridge loaded, add it to your salsa and mix it in. You're not gonna believe the flavor it, it adds, how it boosts it. Even if your recipe has garlic in it already, if you've crushed it, cut it, smashed it or squeezed it, it's not gonna have the impact on your dishes that fresh cut garlic is. That's why you've got people in restaurants, it's their only job, man. They sit there uh. and they mince garlic because so many of their dishes and so many reputations depend on the flavor of the food. And garlic is such a huge part of it, you guys. Mm -hmm. Isn't that beautiful? Absolutely gorgeous. Well, we do have two, so you're at, you can keep one and gift one, or you can always keep one loaded in the fridge. You can keep one on the table. I love the idea of that. Really right? fresh garlic. When you buy it in the, you know, you buy it in the jars or you buy it all minced, it's juicy, it's gross. As soon as you... Oh, oh and I hate oh, to stuff. When you buy in the jars, I double dog dare you mm -hmm. to tell me that you buy those great big jars of minced or crushed garlic, which the second they go in the jar compromise uh, how they taste and look and feel anyway. Yeah. Have you ever gone through that jar? You throw it out every single <laughs> right. time. The garlic master just lets you cut exactly what you need. It isn't appetizing either. As soon as you use the garlic master, you're like, oh, I'm ready to eat. You know, you start <laughs> yep. salivating, you know, that fresh scent of garlic, that aromatic, it's called an aromatic for a reason. Right. Try this. Try just garlic and olive oil and a steak <gasps> or a chicken breast. Oh my goodness. Goodness, you are in for such a treat. We want you to be sure and get this home while we've got them. Very first time you're seeing them, brand new. So get it home for $8.32. Thank you so much. Thank you, you can leave this all here. I'll, I'll, leave I'll all clean that up for you. <laughs> exactly. Um, also, thanks so much, Mark. Now, of course, you can throw this in the dishwasher if you like, or just wash it off in the sink. But if you want a great clean, this is the Better Sponge. It's a set of five colored, textured silicone sponges. So really easy to get clean when you're done. $19.95. I love all the little colors and designs that they've got. It even comes in its own little carrying case, but a real quick uh, non-abrasive clean, and then you just um, stick it. Oh, look how cool. You can stick it even along the side of the sink. Uh, I don't know about you, but for me, what, with sponges, the worst is finding them at the bottom of a whole big pile of dishes. <laughs> Swear my kids, anytime I have my kids wash the dishes for me, I'm like, thank you so much. Now I need a new sponge. Um, but those obviously can't get uh, can't get rotten at all. So a great treat for you with that. Um, great item to be able to pick up as well, $9.98. And if you want to save 10 additional dollars, you can apply for an HSN card. You'll get $10 off of your very first purchase. As soon as you're approved, you can get approved on the phone or online uh, it makes it so quick and easy all right what goes better with a nice Italian garlic pasta than a bottle of wine white or red it doesn't matter but what can ruin your night more than getting cork in the wine or not being able to open it at all or having to wait for somebody this bottle rocket was so popular. We haven't had it back since December because it was one of our number one most giftable items. I received it as a gift. I was so excited. I can now open a bottle of wine without having to get my husband. I was the worst. I was the worst waitress ever. I would go to the bar. I would go to the <laughs> table and I would be like, I. You can open your own, but needless to say, I didn't get a whole lot of tips. Kelly Dietering is here to show us how simple it is to use Hi. the bottle rocket. You get a four piece set today. And also Kelly, one of my favorite, that was it. <laughs> no batteries, no, no batteries. CO2 cartridges. You guys, it's the best way to open wine that I've ever met. Yeah. And, you and get you're, you're getting you not, need. yeah, as I was gonna say, you're not just getting the bottle rocket, you're getting an aerator, you're getting the vacuum sealer, and you're getting the foil cutter. So you're getting all of that, and it comes in a nice little pouch. And that, the aerator is the pour spout. So it actually aerates cool? it as bottle you're top pouring aerator. it. Yep. I love that because sometimes you, you know, you hear like we're supposed to let it breathe. And I'm like, you know, if I open a bottle of wine, I'm drinking it. Yep. So, <laughs> <laughs> I don't open it before I'm going to drink it. This actually aerates it and lets it breathe as you're pouring as you're it. That's pouring my it. speed right there. $24.95. I love that it comes with a storage bag yep. because everything you see here is what you're getting. So you just pick your color. Um, we'll go through the colors. They're so pretty. Golly, we did not have all these colors no, when I, we, when we, I had these at Christmas We can't time. make them fast enough. Oh my <laughs> They're gosh, selling they out every so time we're quickly. on air. So this is the um, purple. We also have, oh my cherry. gosh, cherry. That one's wood. always sold out. <gasps> 
always, how always. beautiful that is. Yeah, I love the copper. Uh, copper, black, and then that beautiful gray. And yep. that's what we've got right now. They make a perfect gift to give anybody. <laughs> that's it. <laughs> now, let me take you through a little tour and go a little bit slower. I'm just showing you how fast you can open a bottle of wine, you guys. So as you puncture the, the cork, basically there's a pin and you give it a couple of pu uh, pushes and it basically infuses just enough air to pop the cork out in seconds. So I'll show you when you get it home because it's a new way of thinking, right? Mm. So rather than twist, twist, twisting and straining our wrists right. and trying to figure out how to get the corkscrew into the, well, open, first of all, and then into the bottle and then how do we align it properly so that, and then you don't have the wrist strength or the arm strength or the hand strength. Yeah. No longer do you need one of these, but you also don't need to keep repurchasing those CO2 cartridges or if you have an electric opener, always charging it or repurchasing batteries. This needs nothing except a couple of pushes. Okay, so there's a pin on the inside and you just pierce your cork and you wanna pierce your cork one time, so just give it a little push. It's very sharp, you push it on the inside. Now there's a little sticker right here that says don't hold here, okay? So okay. don't hold here. That's all I want you to remember right. for that. Hold down at the bottom level, okay? So you see where my hand's going? It's going a little bit lower right where the label is. And then as you start to push, and I'll go really slow, it's infusing just enough air so that it literally <laughs> pops out. And every time you open wine, it, you get that wonderful champagne pop, okay? No. That is what's so special about Bottle Rocket. Everybody's gonna gather around and go, what's that noise? What is that? It's a party opening. I love that you did that too, because when my husband first opened it, he goes, yeah, but I can't put the cork back in. It Comes literally the <laughs> removes the cork yeah. from itself yeah, easily. Exactly. And then you're getting the aerator. All these pieces come included. You're not choosing between. And this is a bottle top aerator. Now, I'm gonna go slow on this one too. There you go, you're done. <laughs> okay. You just pop it on the inside, and then every single bottle that you pour from now tastes like an expensive bottle of wine because you're aerating it. Now, aeration for wine is something that most of us don't take the time to do, but truly, you're actually supposed to open your bottle of wine and let it breathe for 20 minutes. Guess what? Nobody's doing that because right. we, when we're ready to open a bottle of wine, my friends, we're ready to drink it. Exactly. And so we're pouring it right away, and we're not releasing all the beautiful, delicate flavors of the wine. When you have a bottle top aerator like you see right here, that's that triple chamber, okay? Okay. It's actually going to the inside of the aerator and opening up all of the wine molecules so that all the flavors you get are the flavors you're meant to taste mm. with wine. So that's coming included. Then when you remove that and like your husband wants to recork it, mm -hmm. pop the vacuum sealer in. This comes included too. So when you pop that in and you give it a couple of pumps, it's actually removing the air and resealing your bottle of wine. Oh my gosh, How way cool better than that. Stick in the cork in. If you wanted to store your bottle of white, you know, <gasps> sideways in the refrigerator, because you're limited on space. Sure. Or if you bought an expensive bottle of wine at a restaurant and you bring this with your, you know, in your purse, all you have to do is recork it. The restaurant will let you do that sure. and take it home with you so that you're not rushed to hurry up and drink that nice, beautiful bottle of wine. And with this, with this cork, it's going to last longer. So maybe yep. you, you know, maybe you only drink it on the weekends yep. and you want it to be able to be nice the next weekend. I mean, for that to be able mm -hmm. to stay nice, you can't just stick a cork, literally. Stick, stick a, cork a cork in, in it, it. Right? Yeah, you can't do that. Watch how simple and I mean, so I'm gonna go fast a couple more times just to show you. It's so much faster and easier than even doing the electric openers because those take time. You're always having to purchase batteries. You're always having yeah. to recharge it. So with this one, you can see there's a pin on the inside, okay? And all you do is take it and press down, all right? So pierce your cork one time, all right? And then grab down at the bottle level and grab at the top. So it's literally with two hands, give it a couple of pumps and it literally pops open. That's how that simple fast. it is. Yep. It also comes with the cutter as well, so foil it cuts cutter. the little outside of the yep. foil. It's everything that you need. All four pieces comes with this great little almost suede storage bag. Yep. There you can pretty? see how simple that cutter is to use. Um, it, I mean, it is so honestly like Easy. Yeah. Everything, every the single thing here comes. You're getting easy, easy. What a great gift, too. I thought of this as like a little birthday gift or, you know, teacher's gift or, you know, uh, anniversary hostess, gift, hostess gift. House. You know, it's, we're not only buying gifts at Christmas time. We're buying them all year round for yeah. our girlfriends, for our friends, girls' night out. So just take a bottle of wine, attach it to it, put a little bow on top, and gift that. that away. I mean, what a great gift idea. Yeah. You're getting all four pieces, so all you have to do is pick which color you want, and then it will be the simplest, easiest way to open a bottle. Mm that you've ever met. And I just Speaking of color, that we're yes. very, very limited on the purple. So almost sold out in the purple. Last call for purple. Look at that with that beautiful cherry wood. And then we have copper, black, and, and gray for you. But remember, we sold out of these in December. We finally have them back, and we're already <laughs> starting to sell out of colors. Well, can I show you also? So it's very, very... <laughs> 
durable. You don't have to worry about it going bad or, you know, using it over and over and over. This is incredibly durable uh, Triton plastic, okay? Mm. So you, I could stand on this. I'm not one of those people that does that on TV because <laughs> I'll probably fall over. <laughs> That's for Mark Gill. Yeah. But um, I, all you have to do is give it a couple of bangs and realizing how durable, how solid, how sturdy it is. Now I'll go slow on this one, okay? So there's a pin on the inside there. All you do is take the pin and press it onto your cork. It's very sharp. It's very easy to do. I'm going to turn it around. There's a little sticker here that says don't grab here. So when you're trying to open your bottle of wine, don't grab there. Just grab a little bit lower at the bottle level. And then when you're giving it a couple of pumps, you will literally hear and feel the cork popping out. Mm -hmm. Sometimes it takes two pumps. Sometimes it takes three or four pumps. But that's it. I mean, in seconds now, you have opened a bottle of wine. No batteries needed. No CO2 cartridges needed. All you need is your bottle rocket. And it's coming with a little baggie to carry it all together. I love it. So I you're never too. without it. You know, you, you can, um, it's easy to be able to travel with and everything. Oh, yeah. So this is a great opportunity to get the purple. I think that purple is beautiful. Yeah. Of course, it's kind of a Merlot color, we'll call it. Uh, and then you also have, for the first time, I've never seen the wood I know, design. It's, it's always sold out at the holidays. Sold out. Always sold out. It's so yeah. cool. And of course, it's still that Triton plastic, even though it looks like wood. Yep. Copper, black, or gray. And you're getting all four pieces. This pour spout, which is just convenient. $60 because you don't get for, a bottle, for an aerator. Oh, I mean, yeah. easily, all day long, you would yeah. pay $60 for an so aerator. So it aerates and pours. Yep. Then, then you you could easily pay $24.95 just for, just for the vacuum just sealer. Just for the vacuum sealer, easily. And then you're also getting the cutter as well. Mm -hmm. So simple and easy. You get the entire set today for $24.95 and we'll ship it to you for free, which is basically a $10 savings today. Effortless. Literally two, three pumps because it's pushing air into the bottle. It's so easy to use for saving wine. It's leak resistant, spill resistant. Yep. And then that rocket pour helps your wine breathe before drinking. So I know they say, <laughs> take a breath. I can take a breath after. I know. A that's of, that's of the thing though, what we do with our aerators. I have one of those big, clunky, cumbersome uh, bar top aerators, right? It was like almost $100. This is, I'd rather have this any day because now I don't have to make any extra movements. All I have to do is pop that on top and then pour my glass of wine. Now, I don't have to wait 20 minutes for my wine to, you know, mm. breathe and I don't have to swirl it around in my glass. I can literally enjoy my wine immediately. And then let's say I'm done drinking this bottle of wine. I want to save it for tomorrow night or a couple nights. All I do is give it a couple of pumps. Now, with this, when you see it flash back really fast, like you see how it's snapping back really fast, it's done. So it'll take a couple more pumps if you, you know, if there's more wine removed because it's moving air. And then it's totally sealed. You could seal, you know, store this, you know, side, you know, sideways in your refrigerator. You could put this in a car and not worry about it spilling. It's a nice set and people really are going crazy for it. Mm -hmm. Ooh, um, if you look online, out. yeah, there's, Sorry, did we you sell? said crazy. Yes. They are going crazy for it. Crazy for the purple, completely sold out. Gray will be next to go. Uh, if you are on the phone, I know it's, I it's love that noise. It's, it like a great, it's like a party, right? It's a party. Uh, it in really bottle. is. $8 and 32 cents. A lot of you are picking it up now because you're yeah. saving $10 today. You're saving $5 on shipping and you're saving $5 on the price. <laughs> just choose your color. There's the gray, black, copper, and then I'm just at gaga over the, I know, over the wood. The cherry. I've got Isn't the that black, pretty? which is, you know what, to me, at whatever color. Yeah, okay. whatever oh, color. It works. Grab and, one for yourself, grab oh, one yeah. for your girlfriend. I also want to show you how the cork removes. So once you give it a couple of pumps, you you just push the ring. It's actually a cork removal ring. And what's so cool about this is, let's say it's somebody's birthday. It's a 50th wedding anniversary. It's a bridal shower. Whatever it is, a baby was born. You're celebrating. You can now preserve this cork. There's no little tiny bits of cork inside the bottle of wine. Or heaven mm. forbid, have you ever poured a glass of wine as a hostess and there's bits of cork in it? Oh, it's yeah. so embarrassing because you're like, Ugh! and then people, you know, they're automatically like, oh, can I get a spoon to pull the little bits of cork? Yeah. Especially That's older corks. Want. Maybe it's a really nice bottle of wine you've been saving, those mm. older corks will start to degrade and they're very hard to get out unless you're using the bottle rocket. Right. Now the reason that the inventor came up with it, she was having so many troubles, you know, opening and opening thousands of bottles of wine. She was doing it as, a, you know, for her job, for her occupation. She was having wrist issues and all kinds of stuff that she was, you know, having trouble with. So she said there must be a better way and she invented this. And all it does, it's called, we call our airlift technology, but basically what's happening is it's piercing a teeny tiny little hole in the cork. When you you pump it, you pump a couple of pumps of air, and it pops it out like a champagne cork. Wow. And that's, cool? why, that's why it sounds like that. It yeah. sounds like a champagne cork, but perfectly safe yep. because it's all contained right there in the bottle rocket. So here's a little up close slow mo demo <laughs> for you. You see it's pushing just enough air in to remove that cork safely, yeah. easily, so quickly. Honestly,
honestly. And just remember that little tip, you know, lots of people are emailing us, don't grab at the top level, grab at the bottom level. And then when you want to open it, all you do, or take the cork out, all you do is pop it out. And then just as a reminder, this is the most durable plastic on the marketplace. A car could run over this and it probably wouldn't break. <laughs> it's incredibly durable. I've opened thousands of bottles of wine and nothing happens. So yeah. when you get this home, I don't want you to think, oh, it'll open a couple of bottles of wine and then I'll try and be buying another one. Right. That's not what's gonna happen. Yeah. This is very, very high quality, very durable. And then you just grab here and you give it a couple of pumps and you have now a perfectly opened, beautiful bottle of wine that you haven't had to repurchase CO2 cartridges, that there's nothing more annoying than having to purchase those CO2 cartridges or batteries, those kinds of things. And then when you go to pour that bottle of wine that you just opened so nice and quickly and easily with no cork in it, mm -hmm. you just put your little pourer, which on also top. is an aerator, right on top. And look at how this works. This is actually incorporating the air in mm -hmm. through the wine, aerating it's it. It's a triple chamber it aerator. Pours. Yeah. It really is incredible. And the flavor of the wine, if you've never been able to wait for a <laughs> bottle of wine to breathe before, <laughs> it tastes it's better. It's so much fuller. It's so much richer. It's so, it has such a better body and flavor yeah. to it. So normally people would say worth the wait, but this way you don't have to wait. And of course it's no mess, whatever. And then when you are all done, if there's any wine left over, yes, you all you're gonna do it. is just vacuum seal it. Oh, I don't know where our vacuum seal we, went. They're but. on bottles of wine, so uh, I'm gonna grab one from there. <laughs> you pop it on top, you give it a couple of pumps, it reseals your bottle of wine. It also removes the air from the bottle of wine. So it's gonna preserve the wine. You can see right here in our video, there's a great demonstration. It's not only removing the air, but it's resealing your bottle of wine so that the next time you go in for that particular bottle of wine, it's preserved. And it's also basically what we call recorked. I mean, mm -hmm. you know, without having to buy a recorker. So also with the red wines, when you aerate them, with that bottle top aerator that I was talking about, if you know anybody that's ever had a red wine headache, sometimes people find that if they aerate their wine, they won't get those red wine headaches because it actually releases the tannins and some of those bottling chemicals that, you know, give us those headaches. Huh. And so if you're not aerating your wine and you've complained before in the past about getting those red wine headaches, try aerating your wine. That might make a big difference for you. Well, that's really interesting. Interesting. Yep. And a really inexpensive way, if you've never tried aerating or you've never priced aerators, they they're can be, expensive. they really are expensive <laughs> yes. and they're bulky and that's all they do. Yep. All they do is aerate. That's yep. it. They do one thing. This, you're getting a four piece set, which will open your bottle. It's It'll pour aeration. it. It'll aerate. Yeah. It will, um, you also get to store it and mm -hmm. you even have the foil cutter as well. This truly yeah, is pretty. your one stop shop you can for see only the $24.95. You can. So that's actually opening. If you're wondering what it's doing and you can aerate mm -hmm. white, a lot of people don't, you certainly can. Um, but it opens up the wine molecules. It mm. actually releases the flavor. So this is my little tip. If you buy the cheaper bottles of wine, like the 10, 12, $15 <laughs> uh -huh. bottles of wine, and you aerate them, they will taste like the 50, 60, 70 <gasps> dollar bottles of wine. Because it's actually opening up those wine molecules, giving you those beautiful, rich flavors that you want and expect mm. in an expensive wine. But if you don't aerate it, you might get that cheaper bottle of wine taste. So there's my little tip. This might save you money. Now you can buy the BOGO, <laughs> I buy the BOGO wines. Whatever's on BOGO, it's Fine. for me. Wines. That's really great. Oh, now yep. all of a sudden the phone line spiked when you said you could buy the cheaper wines. Buy the cheaper wines. Uh, yeah, you can pour it from a box through the aerator. No. Yeah. Um, okay, uh, $8.32 for you to get home. Gray will be next to go. Choose black, copper, or that beautiful cherry wood. Thank you so much, Kelly. All right, Shannon. I'll save you some wine. Fun, I think I've got right? enough. It I is think, fun. I think, yeah, for my, when I get off at 10 yes. a.m. Okay. Um, Five o'clock somewhere, my friend. There you go. I'm with you. All right, we've got some great hot items for you at hsn.com. You can always check them out. Dash has this premium digital blender. We're not actually showing it to you right there. That's from Heidi Doss. There you go. There's that Dash blender. I adore my Dash blender. And wow, I didn't get it for this price. $189. I don't think we even had that for my host pick price. Holy cow. Um, great colors. This is a powerhouse 1400 watt blender for 189 this there is nothing that this thing can't tackle it'll it'll grind coffee beans and make nut butters and um, shakes and soups and everything you could possibly imagine 37 dollars and 99 cents to get that home it's part of our hot item store and if that's not enough it's a huge customer pick and we've got some great colors that you can't find everywhere all right so that's our hot item store check that out all right Mark is back. All right, so we had the garlic master, yeah, and man. now we've got kind of the pizza master, I'm gonna call it. This is the Reheatsa Microwave Crisper. This is brand new, and it's not just for pizza, but yes, that goes in the microwave, and it crisps. Oh, not, oh holy cow, 
it makes grilled cheese <laughs> in the microwave perfectly. Not soggy, just crispy. $13.32 to get this home. We will ship it to you for free. Oh my gosh. Okay, I use this <laughs> for my daughter's frozen gluten-free pizza, which even gets soggy in the oven. Exactly. And it takes like 45 minutes. It took minutes and I got crisp and gooey cheese. Look at that. I snorted. That's how happy I laughed so hard I snorted. Guys, the reheatsa is going to allow your microwave to do the one thing that you wish it could do. Brown and crisp your food because think about it, you have to fire up an oven to do that or your $200 air fryer. Anything to get those great results or bring back leftovers like you want to. So let me show you how reheatsa works because I'm telling you, it's brilliant. First thing you do is you preheat for about two minutes, all right? Okay. All the instructions are in the box. They're very simple to use. There's an aluminum core at the heart of reheatsa that grabs onto those microwave rays and grabs onto that energy, but transfers it to the non-stick cooking surface. So here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna take our grilled cheese, and I can hear that sizzle already. I love it. Put the lid on. Now listen, the lid is vented. It's gonna let out just enough air so that it's not gonna be soggy. And then uh. that aluminum core heats up the nonstick cooking surface and allows you to grill your food from the bottom while it cooks perfectly from the top. Uh. And then if you need to, you can flip for that extra 30 seconds. And guys, that really is it. Now you told us the story, your daughter, your daughter loves this just yeah. for that. Just for pizza. I mean, if you've got kids and they love frozen pizza, or, you know, let's be honest, you do. Um, <laughs> it takes much more than two minutes just to preheat right? the oven. Then the oven's heating your entire house. Exactly. And you have to use it for just that one thing. And if you're doing frozen pizza, cheese gets everywhere. Right. This is, for me now, my amazing solution for any frozen foods. Well, she's got, she's got, she's all gluten-free now. She's got gluten-free fish sticks. I'm like, really? You want fish sticks? Come on, I can't get those in the microwave. You can now and still get that crisp. Our boy's gluten-free. We can't talk about it. I know. <laughs> <laughs> but it's hard to, it's really hard to crisp up that kind of oh stuff. Oh, my goodness. Hey guys, this is the number one ordered food in the country. It's pizza. Nobody eats a whole pie at night. You come back in the morning, you go to microwave it, and you end up with this floppy mess. We've Eek. all been there. It never tastes the way it does yeah. when you get it from the pizzeria. Well, wouldn't it be nice, instead of firing up that oven, mm -hmm. instead of having to do all of that extra stuff, wouldn't it be nice to be able to simply preheat for about two minutes and heat it up for about 90 seconds. And guys, have a look at that. It's perfect on the top and better yet, oh it's perfect on the bottom. Can you see that? That is gorgeous. It's ooey, it's oh. gooey, it's burning my hand. Totally taking one for the team here. <laughs> <laughs> so here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna put those wow. right there. By the way, you can see how crispy and beautiful that is again. Guys, microwaves make dough out of food. They make, a, like I said, they make it a floppy mess. So when it comes time to reheat that pizza, this is the way you wanna do it. Instead of 15 minutes to reheat your oven and the five or six or seven minutes it takes to get in there with the cheese going all down and causing all the, the smoke and everything, yeah. go ahead, put your reheats in the microwave for two minutes and now you've turned your microwave into a browning and crisping machine. The one thing it can't do that can save you so much time Heatsa allows you to do it. It does. Try it out. Thirteen dollars and thirty-two cents. I was amazed because I was like, "No metal in the microwave. How is this possibly going to work?" But it's new technology mm -hmm. that we've never seen before, and it's and it's innovative. That's exactly. why we're bringing it to you here at HSN because th there's nothing else like it. So you, you get oven quality crispness right from your microwave. So a fraction of the time, exactly. this will heat up to four hundred degrees. I was shocked at that, Mark. Right? BPA free, so safe. PFDA free ceramic nonstick for easy cleanup. And literally, after pizza, all I did was wipe it That's out. It. All you do is wipe it out. That's the only cleanup it requires. We've given you the best quality nonstick surface that you're going to find out there. And by the way, oh my gosh, this is where it starts to turn <laughs> magic because we all know we enjoy and love our fried foods. We go out and we yeah. have our mozzarella sticks or we have mm. our chicken wings or our french fries or mm. our onion rings. And some, a lot of times these turn into leftovers and we all know we're just bringing them home in the doggy bag to make us feel good about ourselves because in two days we're throwing it out anyway because right. there's no way to bring them back to life unless mm. you've spent a couple of hundred bucks on an air fryer or you want to invest 20 to 25 minutes in heating up your oven and reheating your food Shannon I can cook you a gourmet steak in 25 minutes why are you using that kind of time to heat up french fries guys <laughs> have a look at this okay we're talking about perfectly crispy beautiful leftovers 
every single oh, time. Oh my gosh. Steamy and perfect. So I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna take those out of there just like that. Could you imagine turning your microwave into an air fryer? Those air fryers are 150, 200 bucks sure. and they work great. And one of the best things they do is make leftovers and reheat mm. leftovers. That's one of the top things they do. Well, with, re with Reheatsa, you can also cook. So when it comes time for that quick sunny side up egg in the morning or an omelet, you go right ahead. Now we've gone ahead, that's already hot on the bottom. We're gonna give it a little bit of salt, a little pepper, a little bit of that. And now within two or three minutes, instead of pulling out pans, instead of pulling out grills, instead of heating up the oven, yeah. all you need to do is pop this in the microwave for about two to three minutes and you've got a great egg oh in the morning. God. Can you believe that? There and we go. And you didn't add any extra, gr any butter, any grease, nope. anything because of that nothing amazing nonstick and because all you're gonna do is warm it up in the microwave ahead of time. But that's nothing like preheating your oven. Right. Holy cow. Whenever I look at the time, cook time, I'm like, well, let's see, 15 minutes. I can handle that. Well then preheating the oven, you gotta add all that time on as well, and then cleaning the oven afterward. If you're like me and you store a bunch of pans inside your oven, am I the <laughs> only one who does that? It takes a long time to be able to, to, to cook anything in the oven. This makes it so easy, and it really is all about the flavor. So you're getting all that crisp goodness that you love, and it's not just reheating pizza, although honestly, if it was just for frozen <laughs> pizzas, I would take it in a second. I'll tell you what, if it was just pizza, it'd be worth it. So have a look here, guys. This is what people are using it for over and over and oh over again gosh. is either reheating or cooking from scratch all of our family favorites. So if you've gone out that night for wings, if you've, I'm just gonna give our uh, uh, grilled cheese a little bit of a flip here so it's ready and perfect when Ooh. we are. There we go, I'm gonna put that in for about another, for about another minute. There we go. You know, I love this with now. the fried chicken because <laughs> fried chicken is my favorite food in the world. Uh -huh. That would be my final food choice if I had <laughs> one last meal. But when you buy a giant bucket, you know you're going to end up eating it the next day. Exactly. This is per Oh my gosh. Guys, look have at a look at this. You want ooey, oh. gooey, perfect mozzarella sticks that you can feel a little bit better about eating after you've done so you just skip rope with the cheesy mm. you just pulled. Guys, look at this. <laughs> That's what we're talking about. Microwaves don't give you these kind of results. When you use the power of Reheatsa, that over thick aluminum base that grabs that microwave heat, all of those rays, and stores it keeps it away from your food so it's not rubbery, it's not gooey and messy. What it does is it transfers that heat to the nonstick bottom. And by the way, when we talk capacity, you're heating up enough for a family with this, you guys. Mm. This is a great meal for a couple of people. It's a snack for a bunch. Chicken wings that are perfect again the next day. Look at that. They're crispy and beautiful, just like when they came out of the fryer. That's the problem with trying to reheat foods in the microwave, you guys. It gets rubbery, it gets kind of kind of yucky, sure. it gets kind of gross, and I'm just gonna take all of these off here because I want you to see something, okay? When it comes to cleanup, there isn't one. Watch this, that really is it. When we promise you the best non-stick coating we could find for you, I wasn't kidding. How beautiful is that? You can practically see your face in that. Oh. It's <laughs> such a great shine. And that means no additional grease to get the crisp that you're looking for. Exactly, so guys, here we go. Aww. Here's all your french fries, all of your onion rings, your pizzas, your egg rolls, your wings, your mozzarella sticks, and I'm telling you, two minutes to preheat, and another two minutes to reheat leftovers. Wow. If you're gonna cook from frozen and cook from scratch, it's the same two minutes to preheat, and then it's two minutes, flip it, two more minutes. That's it. Mm -hmm. Guys, it doesn't matter what you put in the reheatsa, your food's gonna be done before your oven would even heat up. Oh yeah, easily. <laughs> and as you're showing those French fries, when you go to a restaurant and you get those really good fries, I always end up bringing them home and then they're like wimpy, wimpy gross the next day. They're so gross, the dog loves right, them. Right, right. Um, these come out crispy and delicious. You saw, they're actually cooking a steak here. Cooking grilled cheese exactly. without ever having to, me oh! Cooking marshmallows! <laughs> oh my How goodness! About s'mores, for s'mores, right? Oh, would you ever cook marshmallows <laughs> in your in your oven? You know that they would get everywhere. It would be gross. Exactly. Because this you literally just wipe clean. Thirteen dollars and thirty-two cents for the first time that you're seeing it, and this will just it'll transform the way you cook. You won't even have to use your oven for any of the reheating that you normally exactly. do. Exactly. Uh, and it turns out so beautiful and crisp. You, that'll save you money because eating leftovers really is where we where we end up saving that money. Exactly. And by the way, you can cook in your reheats if you want to do fresh shrimp, if you want to do steaks and burgers. Now we preheated this one. 
Oh, you can hear it. Can you hear that? Give Did you nice hear the sizzle, sizzle, you guys? What <gasps> that's going to do is it's going to start to brown the bottom. It's going to start to cook on the mm -hmm. bottom. That's why you preheat. When you put the lid on, you create a seal, a silicone seal all around there. That's going to keep the heat inside the rehitza, uh -huh. and the vented lid allows just enough to escape so you don't make your food rubbery. And yeah. Nah, nah, nah. yeah. You know what I noticed <laughs> was, did you notice that perfectly chopped garlic on top of the shrimp? That's from the garlic master Where'd that we have available. From? Oh, I wonder. Um, that's like professional garlic right there. Um, here are the features for this microwave crisper. This is the rehitza. It is oven quality crispness straight from your microwave. It heats up to 400 degrees. It's BPA free, PFDA free, ceramic yeah. nonstick for easy cleanup and no additional grease necessary. I say grease because those are the things that we, you're, we're trying to cut down on our fats, but right. we still want the crispy. We still want the flavor. Exactly. For me, if butter is to add flavor, that's what it's for, not for nonstick. Exactly. So guys, here we go. You saw us put a few dishes in live here, cooking them right in front of you on live television because I want you to see how the reheats is going to work for you. In addition to all of your frozen favorites, all of your leftovers. How about this? Now, we started the show with a grilled cheese sandwich. All right. all right. And we put a fresh one in here. It's been minutes, all right? Two minutes, then you flip over. And I'll tell you, I went and watched this halfway through, and this cooks so fast, I almost burned the top. That's how hot this gets. Wow, Guys, can you imagine burning the top of a grilled cheese sandwich in your microwave? It just doesn't happen, mm -hmm. all right? And when it comes time to, ouch, pull this apart. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that. Perfect ooey gooey cheese every time, and nonstick. That's not sticking to anything, you guys. How cool oh is my that? Gosh. Melted Incredible. cheese and nonstick. Can't beat that. We'll be sure that you get yours <laughs> while we've still got them in stock. Uh, we only brought in a limited amount for this launch. All right, one more big reveal. Oh, look at that. Perfect with the pizza. pizza. <gasps> Mark, thank you so much thank for bringing you. us great solutions. It's like it's like a